Hey guys, Doug Miner here. I uh, fell across the notes once from my hair a little bit. I uh, originally recorded this at night, and coming into this uh, beachy area was absolutely gorgeous at night. Uh, I was going to recreate it, but I just want to get back to where I found a spot that I thought would be a great home. If I open up the map real quick, we are down here on this beach. Oh, right, can't drag and drop. <laughs> we will be going through a jungle over to these two chunks. We have um, it's like a mountainous region here, a savanna. So it's, uh, it's got a wide variety of stuff nearby. This is a uh, forest area. There's a kind of a swampy area over here. And uh, picked up some lily pads. Even though in this game you can't walk on them. <laughs> like you can with Minecraft. Unfortunately, I had to come all the way back from my waystone or touchstone so I can have a waypoint. And that's why the uh, chunks are claimed. So I can find my way back. This is uh, absolutely beautiful at night. All these little flowers are lit up. I'll get a video of that shortly. One thing I did show is actually this exact vine is that you can climb up the vines. They don't have to be attached to a block like in Minecraft. You do, however, have to be careful, be careful and not go sideways. <laughs> that is a feral I think it's called a feral. Yeah, feral pixie. They are fairly tough. And of course, now I'm going to really regret it because I think I'm going to go all the way back to world spawn for me. <laughs> Which I may never ever find my home again. Uh, at least I got the map. It is the uh, full day's travel across the frozen ice of nothing. Frozen land of nothingness. Yeah, this looks like World Spawn. Now, why is that claimed? Oh, I came back to my claim spot. Did I really? I did. This is the edge of my claim spot. Well, if I knew it was that easy, I would have killed myself a long time ago. Anyway. Yeah, this way is the... Uh, jungle. See the vines... There's the jungle there. Out this way, which I haven't actually fully explored, but from the map says there's the uh, a little bit of damage there. A mountainous, snowy region, possibly. This is a uh, standard stone here, which is part of the dirt and rock layer, basically. I know they got a specific name, I just haven't checked to really what they actually call it. Then this rock, 
pig stone. I can't mine yet because I don't have the technology. Snow, of course. This game does have gliders. Unfortunately, that is like end game technology, I think. <laughs> or at least in my opinion. So we haven't gained that knowledge. I'm not about to cheat it in. Just to show it off, because this is supposed to be an LP, so. No queen that time, that's the thing. Yeah, if you can get a queen bee from those honeycombs, you can uh, farm them. Another deep dark scary cave. Yeah, once I get some uh, tor te torch technology and other lighting options, I'll. Uh, I'll explore more underground. I do like the natural uh, flowing rivers, which the game originally didn't have. They do get a little bit derpy sometimes. Here's an example where they get derpy. Okay, we got a uh, nice bend. We could do that in real life. Not like they would come this far out and then <laughs> do this, but that's something that can be corrected by man. Yeah, so let me find my uh, my chunks. Behind me, Get the right way, straight up this way. Oop. Can't jump pretty high. You can jump too high, but not pretty high. game can look this good and not like too much. I know my computer lags pretty bad, but this game is just absolutely gorgeous. More of that moss around. Not seeing any on that tree. Need some bind technology. Some moss. 
not the best torches in the world, but until I can find some coal and some other stuff, I'm just going to have to do. Anyway, I think I'm going to settle down in this little valley. A little thing I made earlier that uh, I'm going to show MJ. Look, dirt slabs, dirt ramps. Well, these are grass, but they make dirt ones too. <coughs> so yeah, there's uh, one dream of yours that Minecraft refuses to give us for some reason. I think it has to do with that block ID thing that they're having. See if I can find me some more wheat. I got, well, can't, I really can't do anything with wheat until I have a hoe. But yeah, this is uh, this is gonna be home. And there's a keeper. I need him. Hello, keeper. Where'd he go? Oh man, I lost him. I need your arc stones, buddy. Where'd you go? Darn. Oh well. Ah, oh, I didn't one. So, first things first is uh, do some tree clearing, build a house. Yeah, the Minecraft unit crafter in me wants to say punch a tree, but of course you don't punch trees in this game. Suck them up. <laughs> anyway, guys, I am going to get my touchstone down. And this is my home. I'm going to wait just a little bit because it is getting nighttime. And I will run into the jungle so you guys can see it. At night, lit up. Maybe even recover my stuff. to keep it your back, huh? Lost you. Unfortunately, those guys can jump higher than I can. Uh oh, there he goes. He glitched out a little bit. Give me this much trouble. There we go. And that is what I'm after. Arc stuff. Gunpowder's nice too, but I don't know if you can see that the uh, flowers are starting to light up. Lovely jungle canopy. This is another derpy spot in the river I found earlier. <coughs> there is our savannah, the edge of it. I'm not going after that one, guys, I promise. 
want my stuff. Mainly because it's got my processor in it. get it and teleport back before anything decides to come after me. This might take a little bit, guys, so I'm going to cut it here, and I will see you in the morning. Peace.